So finally, Future and Metro Boomin have released their new project. Very wholesome album. I'm sure no controversy could come from this album whatsoever. All the takes around it are extremely calm and reasonable. Either way, in today's one, I'm going to be trying to make a beat in the style of We Don't Trust You. All right, so I'm in FL Studio once again, but I think just for the first one, I'm going to try and make the most vanilla, like stereotypical Metro Boomin type beat that I can make. I do want to make a beat in the style of like that, but there's a lot going on on that track, and true say, I don't have very long to record this. So I think for my reference, I'm gonna use the track called Ain't No Love. So I think the melody on this one has a piano, so I'm going to open up Keyscape real quick, and I'm just gonna pick the one that I use the most often, which is this one, and I'm just gonna try to come up with the chord progression, so. <laughs> What's wrong with this chord? First thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna select everything and then just lower the velocities and randomize it a little bit. And I can't lie, right now this melody is kind of boring. Wait, what is this tool actually called? Slice? bad start it's a pretty simple melody so i also remember seeing this comment a while ago to this i just want to say generally don't take everything that you see online too seriously because i'm sure for you it looks like it took two seconds to make that i've been here 13 minutes bro premiere pro is a beautiful thing man i find melodies really difficult to make sometimes moving on i want to layer this with something and i haven't used this plugin in a while so i kind of just want an excuse to use it again i'm no longer an analog lab 5 enjoyer i'm now an electra x user this one sounds pretty good, but I don't really like the hissing sound that comes with it, so I might just duck the octave a little bit. Brother, why is there an Among Us on my keyboard? I kinda want something to fill out the background a bit more, so I'm gonna go for an effects preset. Spooky. I think I might just throw a bass line on it real quick. running out of ideas for this one so I might just open up the funny the samples from this pack by the way it's pretty good I like this one I think for a string sound I'm gonna use the cello from session strings Go with this one, maybe. Mm, I'm not too sure about this melody, but I might just move on for now. Can't believe I paid for this sample. some leads on this one for sure, so I'm gonna open up Hive again. I mean, it sounds kind of dumb, but I'm gonna go with it anyway. 
I haven't used this VST in a very long time. I'm gonna look for another lead sound in here. start laying down some percussion before I add something that I actually regret. completely satisfied with all the sound selection on this one so i think real quick i'll mix everything down and arrange it and then we can play the final beat i've arranged the whole beat and i've mixed everything down main thing i did is i fixed the levels of all the melodic elements and just simple things like i added some distortion and some reverb to the lead melodies and i've also added the acapella for the reference track that i was going for and i think overall this sounds like the most like 2017 metro Boomin type beat i've ever heard this is very much like a pov you watch the metro Boomin razor tutorial either way before i play the final beat i want to say a big thank you for watching and hopefully if you're trying to make some beats in this style then this video helped you in some way very interested to see what people think of this album, what their favorite tracks are. Don't use all of this answer, pick something interesting. But yeah, this is what the final beat sounds like.
Wanna go to war, gotta send out a slug. Nick, I let me spray in the car. Mine on point, nigga, I stay key. Said if I care, there ain't no compete.